everybody, it's Teresa Spagala here and for today's Around the Town segment we're here at Lit on Fire Used Books. There are literally thousands of books here, let's see if we can read them all. Located just east of the hilltop down West Main, Lit on Fire Used Books sits sandwiched in the cozy space between quantum health and costume trunk. Inside you won't be surprised with the visuals. It's a bookstore, tidy but comfortable, as expected with a warm glow that will tempt even the uninterested reader to step inside. You'll notice immediately that some of the shelves housing the books are coated in graffiti, but it's not the ordinary kind. Lit on fire encourages passers-by to take a sharpie and add their own touch to the collective before picking up something to read and resting upon one of the many couches. The shelves by themselves give the place an amazing sense of community, which is exactly what the owner, Jessica Stephenson, wanted yeah, so to do. Once a month, uh, I have an open mic event, which is focused mainly on poetry, but people are welcome to tell short stories, uh, read from their books that they've written. Um, this is a really great community uh, that we have of poets and uh, musicians and stuff, and they really... They really love each other and they hold each other up. But Lit on Fire wasn't always located on West Main. In fact, their new location is only just over a year old as of September. It was so difficult. I was exhausted. I had two weeks to move. We managed to throw all almost 10,000 books on rolling carts and roll them around the block <laughs> from the old location, which is only I'd say it's maybe like a half a city block away, but it's still a long ways to move. With a new location always comes new possibilities. Lit on Fire has frequent events throughout the month, so be sure to check out litonfireusebooks.com for the latest. For BUTV News, I'm Tirza Sprigella.